hoping everything goes on without a glitch. Emily Dean is live at City Hall in Green Bay with more. Hi, Emily. Good morning, Rachel and Pete. Good morning, everybody. Happy Election Day. We're out here at City Hall in Green Bay, seeing how they're preparing for this big day. And Doug Dahl, former Green Bay City Clerk and now Election Specialist, is here with me. And today, you know, problems could occur. What do you, um, what's your goal for today and what is your position for today? Well, my position for the day is to ensure that the elections go smoothly, mechanically, and for the voter. Um, basically throughout Brown County. The City of Green Bay contracts with Brown County to supply election support throughout the county. And here we have kind of an emergency kit that you bring along yeah. with you people if there's something that goes wrong. Let's take a look. What usually do you carry in this? Well, all the machines have a, a tape in them that records what happens at the polls. It records the results. It records the opening information and if a, a problem should occur during the day. Um, inside we have a flag. All your polling location should have a flag displayed outside the entrance to the poll and then the rest of the equipment are just things that poll workers may need. There's light bulbs, there mm. are, there are um, extra twine and there are pens and there is tape and all those necessities but probably the most important thing that we use during the course of the day are our, our radios. We're in, there are four of us out in the field all day long. We're in constant contact should a problem occur. Mm -hmm. We're radioing each other most of the day. And there's a lot of work that goes into us. Here's the ballot uh, box that we have over here that would, if anything, need maintenance. And this is kind of taken apart that you can see. A lot of work goes into this. Someone could be called out. Uh, another thing, too, yesterday, people were already out setting up ballot machines. Um, there's a lot of work that goes into this. And people in the community, you know, that work together, come together to put it up. How long does it take, you know, to put all those machines out? How long have people been out doing this? Well, the staff at City Hall has been working on this for at least a month. They're taking absentee ballots, people are coming in, they're voting the absentee, and the um, voting mechanics set up the machines. They start on the Wednesday before the election, they start testing every machine, every ballot type goes through the machines to make sure they work, and the crews start on Friday setting up the polling locations. So it's a big team effort. It's a big team effort. <laughs> All right. Thanks for joining us this morning, Doug. Hope everything goes smoothly. Happy Election Day, everybody. We'll send it back to you.